Yeah. Was it always footy for you as a kid? That was it. You oh, knew that yes. was it. Hundred percent. There is no plan B. No, 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 no. All, always football. But a kid in the seventies in the suburbs in Melbourne. Yeah. Uh, his, his one hour of glory each week besides playing junior footy on a Sunday was watching the big replay and they played one hour of football yeah. at 7.30 on a Saturday evening. Yeah. To me, it was like looking at the WWE. You yeah. know, they had their names as they entered the arena. As a seven, eight-year-old watching this, I thought, league football. They will come to the edge of the ground on conveyor belts. They will be given everything. Until I went to Hawthorne, we had worse club rooms than Frankston Rovers. You kidding? <laughs> oh, that was shocking. And it, <laughs> like some of the times we went to St Kilda at Moorabbin Oval, they used to say, "Oh, they turned the hot water off." There was one time twenty of us had to walk through the car park at Moorabbin in our dressing gowns, fully clothed in our football gear, because St Kilda were dirty. We beat them. They turned the water off. <laughs> They actually didn't even give us water. <laughs> so, so, uh, the great. image of you in a dressing gown, I'm guessing it's like a silk kimono, yes? It was. It was bright yellow. <laughs> of course it was. The Christian O'Connell Show.